Oh my god, the keys were there the whole time. Ah. Oh. Yo, what's up guys? So, today, we'll be playing some more Anthem. And in the last video, I unlocked the new Ranger Javelin. So, in this video, I'll be trying it out and showing you guys what abilities it has and what abilities it has to offer. I'll also share my own personal opinion on the Javelin and uh, see what I can recommend it for and see if you guys need to use it or if it's not worth using. And before you ask guys, the Roblox video will be coming soon. I just got to get all my friends rounded up and then we'll, uh, we'll have a bit of fun. Before we get into the video guys, I've got one question for all of you. How do you like the style of the videos at the moment? Do you like them? Do you think I should do crazy edits? Or should I do a mix of both? It's up to you. Leave your comments below and let me know. You know you're a real YouTuber when you're supposed to be setting like goals. So, the like goal for today's video, guys, is 10 likes. Doesn't sound like much, but for me, it's a lot. And if you hit it, I'd appreciate it so much. So, with all that out of the way, guys, let's get into it. Right, so, today we'll be testing out my Ranger Javelin. And before we do that, let's have a look at my daily challenges. Uh, world events, six. Okay. So we're going to test out my new javelin by completing six world events. So that right there, guys, is my new javelin, the Ranger. And it's kitted out with full Legion of Dawn armor that you get for pre-ordering the game. So these are the abilities that I equipped last video. And unfortunately, I didn't have enough materials to upgrade my support gear. So my grenade slot, I have the default frag grenade. Thrown grenade that explodes in a large area. For my assault launcher, I have a seeking missile. Launches a missile that tracks... T so as the support gear, I have a bulwark point. Deploys a spherical shield that blocks projectiles over the ranger's position, which is pretty cool. And these are all of the components I'm using. I'm not going to read out the descriptions because it would just take an eternity. Then, like I said, I have full Legion of Dawn armor. Now, in my opinion, this armor looks extremely cool, especially on the ranger. And unfortunately, I didn't pre-order the other editions of the game to get the Legion of Dawn armor on the other javelins. Overall, I'm quite excited to try this thing out. Let's go. Here we are. Alright, Seeking Missile. Ah, doesn't do the most amount of damage, I've got to say. Hello mateys, pretty good radius, last radius from the frag grenade, here we go, a world event, finally, this is a really weird world event, you have to pick up these sort of orb thingies to open a vault, so after this world event and the next one, I'm going to end the expedition, the reason for this is so I can put on new uh, new abilities that I've unlocked from the world events. Alright, well we're failing miserably. I can't find the orbs. Six. Here we go. Seven. Eight. Finally! We did it. See that... This tracking rocket isn't even powerful enough to take out a single enemy. That's disappointing. It's probably because it's such a low power though. Here we are. Purples. Here we go. This is a big step up. Right, so I'm going to do one more world event and then see what loot I can get from that. And then I'm going to see what I can equip. Ah, oh, screw it. Let's just waste the ultimate ability here. That's pretty cool. Big barrage of rockets. That is 
That'll be powerful against bosses, definitely. So it looks like the melee is like a arc rod of, or like an electric rod of some sort, or like a blade, empowered by like electricity or something. Aha! World event. This is going to be the final one before I try and upgrade the abilities on this. This world event is extremely boring. Oh. Is this seriously the whole thing? Just going around picking up things? Well, that was an easy world event. Give me the loot. Danny P, hit me up. Alright, so I'm going to end the expedition so I can see what loot I've gathered so far and see if I can upgrade any abilities. So, a better frag grenade and a different assault launcher. So, grenade. Frag grenade, upgrade that, get rid of this. After a charge up period, blasts pulse of raw energy. Alright, so, let's go find another world event and test out these new abilities. What's, whoa! Whoa, a treasure chest! Alright, place this thing here. Damn, that was quick. How many purples? Only one. Only one. Here we are, fought from the final world event, I think. Alright, let's screw it. Big barrage of rockets. Finally. Done. Wait, don't tell me. Purple. Did I see it? Oh my god! Boys and girls, we just got a masterwork. Oh yes, we just did, didn't we? Holy bejesus. What's a good way to end the video? Here we go. What is it? It's the exact same thing I've got. No, you're kidding, aren't you? I'm actually disappointed. I mean, yes, it's one power level higher, but... Would you look at that? The exact same bloody thing. Oh, we may as well equip it. Let's just keep it because I want to show off that I've got two masterworks whenever people have a look at my character. So, my first impressions of the Ranger Javelin is... I don't think it's the best javelin, considering that I only have the starter abilities, I don't think it's the most fun to use. Also some of the abilities don't do enough damage to kill an enemy within one shot, which is quite disappointing. Like I said, these are only my first impressions, so my opinion might change tomorrow, depending on how long I use it for, but this is just a first time use of the javelin. So overall, from using it for the first time, I'd give it a 6 out of 10. It's not the most enjoyable, and the starter abilities don't do the most amount of damage. So before any of you start asking, Why have you got different clothes on, man? It's because yesterday I forgot to film an outro, so I'm going to do one now. So I just want to say thank you, thank you for taking your time out of your day watching my video. All support is greatly appreciated. Roblox video is coming soon, I promise you that. Thanks again for all the support, and I'll see you guys in my Roblox video. See you all in a bit.